There's been a major weird exploit slash targeting of the WD MyBook Live drives. These are kind of like NAS drives, but they're a single hard drive just connected to the network. I used to have some of these back in like 2014. Uh, they got super slow over time, but it's effectively like a singular external hard drive connected to the network. Um, they also have the MyBook Live Duo, so I guess technically that's two hard drives. Um, but they, they are essentially NAS drives, but there is an exploit that's being comp that's compromising these drives and people are just hitting factory reset on them or wiping all of the data. And multiple users have reported issues with this and it seems to be spreading. And WD has literally nothing to offer but to take your MyBook Live drives off of the network. They were actually apparently really quiet and just kind of not responding to this at all for a while. And it seems like they finally released the statement, which is what this article is about, saying that at this time, we just recommend you disconnect your MyBook Live drive from the internet to protect the device. And that's it. Like, they, they have nothing to offer but to just take your drive off the internet, which is amazing. Like, oh boy, I feel bad for anyone who has bought these. Uh, here's one of the threads of someone being like, message in the GUI says, factory reset today. All the data is gone. Now, uh, actually, I think it was Gamers Nexus that was talking about this, not Lineside Man. So you do have, of course, like, as a singular drive like this, just doing a factory reset without doing, uh, without doing, like, a zero out or anything. You do have the ability to recover your data. It's not fun. It can be expensive, especially because you probably have to send it off to someone to do it. So it's probably pricey, and for most users, they're probably just going to, you know move on, unfortunately, which sucks for those who are losing data that they really need, especially if they were using it as some sort of backup or something. But this is a terrible situation going on right now. Um, and it's really unfortunate to see this. I, I frankly, like, after my experiences with them, which again, this was like seven years ago, but back in, actually more than that. Well, no, seven years ago, back in like 2014. I frankly can't really recommend them especially this is apparently saying the last firmware update they even got was in 2015 but holy hell this is just a huge mess i just wanted to highlight it in case any of you out there have a my book live drive hooked up or you know a family member does uh make sure they go unplug that right now because if they even try to mess with it you know to run an update or to reset everything or whatever because they think something went wrong with it you could actually delete all of the data and as chandler's pointing out in chat uh, yeah, it seems they don't have a clue what to do about it. So, assuming that they just don't come up with a solution, um, we might be looking at, like, a class action lawsuit kind of scenario. Um, but, I, I, I don't know. It's just a huge mess. I just wanted to help signal boost that if you have anyone out there, take it offline, please, quickly.